kissed my ass. I was like, hello, what? Thank you. I want to confirm. Go and see the prodigy. That is so good. Happy Father's Day, mate. Thank you. Best Father's Day ever. Oh, it's gross when you just brush your teeth. I have been procrastinating for three hours. Well, actually, I've been doing work, but I've been doing work to avoid going to the gym. So, yes, I've been procrastinating. I can't believe this day has come to go back to the gym. It, I don't know what it is. Why is it so difficult? Like, when you're in the routine, it's fine. But to go back after not being for so long is just... just it's impossible. It's not doable. It's impossible. We're going to do it. I'm going to try and enjoy it. Hopefully, it'll get me back into the swing of things. Oh my God. And then I got my nail appointment at five o'clock. <gasps> like I can't wait. But also, I really, I'm really enjoying these short nails, so I don't know if I can wait. Maybe I can wait. Let's go, procrastinating again. I ain't ever going back there and you can't make me. <laughs> I'm glad I went. I'm glad I went. Hopefully this is the start of me going back to the gym again. I think I've decided though, I want to cancel out RDLs. And I know that's a bit of a giver up a attitude to have, but just the thought of them, I, I, they're just really fucking hard. Like not like physically, but like just getting the technique right. And I shouldn't just give up, but the thought of doing them fills me with dread. And I, I really don't feel like I'm doing much when I'm doing them because I just think I can never get it right. I can never get my form correct with them. So I'm thinking, do I just cut them out? Because sometimes if you really just don't like an exercise, just fucking cut it out and do one that you do like. Cause... Wow, it's fucking hot. <laughs> oh, there was this guy that came up to me. He was like, can I just say your hair's awesome? I was like, hello, what? Thank you. Look at it. This is the hair in question. I was like, fucking shit. That was very sweet though. Thank you. The good news is it's fucking hot enough to have the smoothie bowl. Let's go. I'll only have like an hour when I get in, then I'll have to set off my nails. What is that? I literally had time to put like five things on vinted. I mean, but I mean, it's better than nothing. I think that's the way to do it for me. Maybe like five things a day, because I'll just never fucking do it. I'll never do it. Five things a day is like short and easy. I'll probably never do that either. I'm just shit. I've just got too much to do. I can't can't face it my little brain can't face it anyway <laughs> and i um scrubbed off most of my tan because i got this thing uh mac thing at the traffic center tomorrow but i'm not sure if i want to go sometimes i'm just like i don't know it's always so much effort and getting there and then i'm just like do i go do i not go because uh, I'll have to redo my tan and I was thinking no I'll just wear I'll just cover up I can't cover up in this heat can I, I just it's just not feasible so I, that means I have to redo my tan and uh, god it is a high maintenance life it's a high maintenance life anyway on my way to my nail appointment praise the lord praise the lord because I am looking very scruffy uh yeah I think I'm just gonna go I'm getting almond because I want to be a princess I have I don't know, one to the almond, almond shape over the past week or so. Um, but I've always wanted it. Shut up, Jenna. Right, so yeah, that's what I want. Just an almond plain French because I just need pretty and something that I'm gonna love after having this, this. Oh, and by the way, me and Jake are going seeing Harry Styles in Wembley on Friday. Little Jakey fucking whipped the tickets out of the bag, surprised me. So, yeah, I'm very excited. Oh, by the way, forgot to even say, because <laughs> Jolie does her um, Thursday appointment at Pellis and Co, but she's not in this Thursday or night service, so she's doing, she's doing me out of schedule hours here. So we're doing, she's doing my nails at Glossy Vine HQ. <laughs> how cool, how crazy. I'm here right now. It's well cute. It's like a little bungalow. Yes, this is what we want. Oh, 
just been waiting for a thunderstorm to happen for like an hour. Oh no, it's slowing down. Ladies and gentlemen, the nails of a female. Fantastic stuff. It was like nearly, it was on the edge of thunderstorming the whole time we was in there, it just never did. And we were both so excited for it to thunderstorm, it just fucking didn't. So hopefully it does by the time we get home. It's pretty late, what time is it? It's like nearly eight o'clock, I'm starving. All I've had today is a little speck of ham. I'm trying to do what Jake does one meal a day, nah. I thought the monster would fill me up, it did. But now I'm like ravenous. Oh, I've just gone to put my maps on to go home and it says, Warning, severe thunderstorm. Warning, route may be affected by thunderstorm. I've got a fucking electric car. It's either gonna blow me up or it's gonna charge my car. What, what? So for this actually looks vile, this. The cylinder eyes shut and the mouth. That is rank. Tram. Running straight to the gym this morning. It's five to eight, no messing, no messing. Look at my nails. I'm a girl. Mm, I missed out two of my exercises today. I just felt like I didn't have the energy. Everything was really hard today. Um, but today I didn't have the monster, so maybe I'm going to be addicted to monster. Maybe I'm going to be addicted to monster. It wasn't that bad yesterday because I had half in the morning. Half in the morning. And then the other half at like dinner time. Oh, I can't be that girl that drinks Monster and is addicted to fucking Monster. <laughs> but if it helps in the gym. It's only as bad as pre-workout really, isn't it? So, and it's sugar free, it's sugar free. Nightmare shit. We're supposed to be going to this thing, this Mac thing at the traffic centre. But I need to charge my car and we're getting the drive clean so I can't park in the drive. What the fuck am I gonna do? Oi, look at this. I'm actually going to an event like this. I've got zero fake tan on, not a single drop of makeup. I've got greasy, messy hair. And I've got some little fucking girl next door outfit on. What is this? Denim shorts and Converse. Yeah, but do you know what? I just thought it's it's a drop-in thing. It's not a big event. It's not like a crazy thing. It's just like a, it's just a little thing. Do you know what? I'm going in my human body as it is. Uh, yeah, I was gonna put some tan on, but then I thought, why would I put on tan just for this one hour thing? Well, and then it's like going gammy every day until Friday when I, I want my tan to look terrific for Harry Styles. So it just all seemed a bit stupid, and I don't want to be walking around in the sun in sticky tan. So this is why I look like a worm, but I don't mind. Yeah, I don't mind. I'm not bothered. What is that in the road? Okay. I've got a state of beauty and Oh, I don't know why I want the skims. So I've never got skims in my life, but we've released all this cute pink stuff. And I'm just, you know, the Valentine stuff was cute. But really, it's just very overpriced, isn't I just it? I think it won't wash well. It's so overpriced. <laughs> it's like, look at me. Then look at me. Well, you've adopted me. Do you know what? I actually would adopt you now. You have a perfect child. <laughs> She's had one. She's had two seconds. She's had two seconds. It's fucking daytime. Holiday. Had too much prosecco and just got. What is that? She's had four proseccos. Four. You had four proseccos. Look at this. Who get? I hate apple. I can't believe. How much did you pay for that? Two swindly wings. Two. That's not as bad as I thought, but still. Too many changes every I time like I come. That. Where's the pool? I was going to go swimming. That's weird. How did they even get rid of that? Bands and everything. Hi. That was just a really quick thing. It was just like a drop in. And then, yeah, it wasn't like an event event. Nice glass of Prosecco. Bit of the Mac products. Got a boost. Went for a different one today. I always get the Mango Magic. I just literally found one that I liked and me being me, never ever ordered anything other than that again because I'm too scared to try it. You know what, it's too expensive to try another one. Because if you pay six, the six pound now, you know, six pound. You pay six pound and you don't like it. It's game over. It is game fucking over. What I did was though, I always use Chloe's um, fucking 
student ID her uni days. And for ages, she thought it'd run out. But I know that it's it's going on for five years, that fucker, five years. So I'd been using it and I'd changed the picture, you know, when you go on the uni days app, I'd changed the picture to me. But she never changed it back. Usually when I let someone use it, it'll go from me to them, me to them, because obviously they're always using it and changing the picture. She didn't know it was happening, so it was always me. I clicked on it today and because I, I told her it, it was extended and then it was Chloe's face and I was like, quick, I was trying to change it before my eyes. I was like, can you use my student ID? She's like, yeah, of course. And I'm like, I see Chloe's face and I'm like, yeah, just one second. My, my internet's a bit slow. And then I turned it around and she was like, yeah, that's fine. Get 15% off, eh? I don't even know how much I got off, but 15%, that's fine. And then she was like, I'm watching your name and I realized it said Chloe and I was like, Chloe. <laughs> And then he shouted out Chloe and I didn't reply because I'm not called Chloe. <laughs> funny, funny, funny. Let's see if I can even do that maths after school. So 10% of six pounds has got to be 60p, right? So then 5% is 30p. So I got 90p off that, yeah? That's not bad. I really hope that's right. I believe in myself and I think that's correct. Yeah, I'm going to say that's fucking correct. That's well correct, that I know it is. Yeah. I'll have to ask Jake. But I mean, I got a whole pound off there. <laughs> got a nice boost out of the situation and now I'm going home. Oh my God, did I even tell you? I think I did tell you. I think I told, yeah, I did tell you, didn't I, about the air fryer. You can request products on TikTok shop and I requested it and I actually got it. It's fucking huge. It came this morning. I didn't even know it had been shipped. It is in the biggest box ever. It's a 6.4 litre one. Jake's mum's gonna go mad. Because it's an eyesore and Jake's mum's kitchen's all about, you know, beautiful but things that you're not actually allowed to touch. So, <laughs> I don't know what we're going to do with this giant fucking... Ah. And I'd take it to my house but I'd, I'm always at Jake's, we cook at Jake's, you know. My mum would go mad too because he's fucking ugly, it looks like a big bin. Um, <laughs> I just want a nice box or even a house to just put mine and Jake's stuff in then it's ready for when we move out and I don't have to look at it because now where do I put the giant air fryer in my room no yes yeah, so I can't wait to use that obviously we won't be able to do that this weekend maybe on Sunday when we're back from London we'll have an air fryer day once again I've got to do a big clear out because I've fucking got too much stuff again two hours 40 minutes later the task is complete my god right i've just can you even see this shit i need full lights in here right everything fits There's nothing in any washing basket i'm taking out all the stuff i'm not gonna wear um i need to move these to my home section because no one in my family fucking cares i don't know about anyone else but i could literally i could sit every single one of them down and i could say hi please 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 don't put these in the dishwasher. I've bought them and I love them. Uh, and they're mine. I will hand wash them. Please don't put them in the dishwasher if you see them. I could sit down and say that eye to eye with every single one of them. And they'd still do it. So I just, I've started putting my things in a box for when I do move out, whenever that may be. I need to fix these, I need to fix this. Anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Majority of winter... Jumpers, coats, upstairs, um, pants. I really tried to narrow those down, but I just, I can't, I can't, I can't. And then, yeah, I still need a situation for these perfumes. Like, I need, I need, like, a tray. Or I, I'm beginning to think I shouldn't have ever got rid of all my box display, but it was a waste of room. It was a big, fat waste of room, so, yeah, I should have. I had them in these crates, but then I couldn't see what they were. I need a big, fucking, fat tray. A fat fucking tray. How can I get a tray that big? That's not hideous. Anyway, yeah. I need to go through bags as well tomorrow, but I need to sell stuff tomorrow. Will it happen? Probably not. Fans out, especially summer. Fuck me. If anyone ever wants to waste a hideous amount of money, get a Dyson fan. They're fucking shit. They are so shit. Why, why does it even need to be like that? Just get a normal fan, honestly. Jake's got a normal fan. It's probably about 20 quid. This was... I don't know how much this was, but... It's shit. <laughs> Jake's fan's way better. Look at my summer PJs. 
little pink crop top and then these oh little so oh so cute good morning i was naughty had a nice sleep in my own bed and i slept until well i went to bed at half one to be fair but i slept until 10. i only woke up because i don't know why my phone seems to turn itself off do not disturb just woke up to it vibrating a million times fuck off fuck off Otherwise, I would still be asleep. Right, I think it's best. I think it's best that I woke up. It's nice to wake up to a tidy room. I need to sell stuff today. Sell stuff, edit vlogs. I think eating breakfast outside turned out to not be a good idea. Fuck. Oh, look at them. Gorgeous. Jay's mum got me some flowers. <laughs> Bless her. For literally because I took her order back to Traffic Centre. I think I've done it twice. <laughs> it's very nice, very kind. I love them. They're beautiful. And she knows that I like peonies, so. It sounds like I'm saying peonies, doesn't it? Peonies. Peonies. I don't think they last very long, peonies, though, do they? And you always get one that does not bloom, which is really annoying. I'm sure it will. I'll put it in the sun. I literally. Spent the whole day trying to plan this London trip. The whole fucking day. Because, I mean, central London's here. Wembley's all the way up there. So, I've been trying to find a hotel that's reasonable. It's not fully booked. It's not fucking overly priced. We're not going to die in. But it's not too far away from Wembley. But it's also kind of central. <laughs> so it's taken me ages. I've found something that I like. It's dead cute. It's an underground thing. It's not bad price. It's the closest I could find to Wembley, but also to London. So yeah, that's taken me all day. Whoa! How have they grown back so fast? Laser hair removal just did not work on me. But annoyed that I went through with it actually, because it was completely pointless for me. Completely. So I've got blonde hair, but I thought my armpits were a bit brown, but maybe they're not. How annoying. <laughs> Oh god, it's five past eleven and I'm really tired. I don't want to get up and do my tan, which really I don't need to because I need it done for Friday. But I'm thinking, I don't know if it's necessary. I want to try on my outfits tomorrow. I don't want to try them on with tan on. Or should I just stop being pathetic and just do it tomorrow? I think I should stop being pathetic and do it tomorrow. Yeah, I think I should, because I'm too tired. Because I need to wash my hair as well. Yeah, let's all be sensible. I'm just currently browsing, browsing through Pinterest. Because it really helps with planning outfits. Like, sometimes, I don't, I don't know why it helps so much, but it just does. I'll look in my wardrobe, and I've got all this stuff that I obviously love, because I bought it. And I'm just like, I've got nothing. I know everyone says that, but I'm just... I literally look at this fucking wardrobe and I've got nothing. There's nothing I can wear. And then when I see outfits on Pinterest, I'm like, well, actually, I've got that that I could wear as that and that that, and that would look good. Yeah, I like a Pinterest um, night. See, it sounds awful because... Well, I don't know why it sounds awful, but when I'm not with Jake, I just get so much done. I would never have the time or the concentration for this when I'm with Jake like I'm gonna he's got a big work thing tomorrow he's going down south so I just thought I just have a few nights at home um because we're gonna be spending the weekend together well we spend every day together but yeah I've just been smashing out the editing and doing bits of stuff that I like doing when I'm on my own such as Pinterest browsing it's nice it's nice to have time for this so currently I've typed in Sophia and Chintzy outfits because there wasn't that many for summer outfits 2023. I was struggling a bit and Sophia and Chintz always have amazing outfits. So yeah. And then these are some of the things that I've added for today. See they have such nice backgrounds. I don't have nice backgrounds near me unless I want to mooch to Manchester which I don't want to do. Gotta put in the effort Jenna. Gotta put in the effort and look at all these. Oh so cute and then i oh, really want them boxer shorts i love boxer shorts i've literally got them pants that top just it's nice and simple never wear it never wear it oh, 
obsessed. I have this top, but I don't have a denim skirt, but that is my plan. Yeah. You're all amazing. Oi, look at this matte section. Look at it. How gross does that look? Does not look good, does it? But I mean, that's just what you get. It's not like, I'm not a scruffy bitch, right? This is how they go. This is how they go, the bonds, okay? Well, lots of hair extension methods, Matt, after a couple months, don't they? But some people go, see, like, you just have to pull them apart, like these two, they're stuck together. Stop fucking ripping them apart. Gently, gently, as much as I can. But, yeah. Um, some people can go six months until they get new bonds, or in my case, get them moved up. Not moved up, but like the head's topped up, cut off, and then re put in. But yeah, like look at that. I tried to go a little bit of extra time this month. This month. So basically, the first time I went after three months because I was freaking out that my my bonds were matted. But then I went to the woman. She was like, "Yeah, this is this is pretty normal. This is how they end up." Um, but yeah, some people can do six months. That's crazy. So I left it an extra month this time, four months, and. I don't think I'll do that again. Just, I tried to save a bit of money, but I think I will be going every three months, unless I change method. I don't think I will. I just really like this method, but I think I can't do four months. I can't do it. I don't know how people do that. They must really, like, strictly follow the rules. Strictly. <laughs> but, yeah. I just thought I'd try and brush through them now. I think I'm booked in on the 22nd next week. What day are we on? So it's like, it's just another week. It's just another week we can do this. We can do this. Whenever I go in anyway, they always say, oh, we've seen much worse than this. So it should be all good, but I am going to sit and try and separate them and brush through for a little bit. Jesus Christ, man. It's like a dumpster. Quite a productive morning and it's only half ten. I've paid my remaining tax amount, sorted out car insurance, put some money in some sort of new savings account for the house, um, uploaded a vlog, uploaded another vlog, I think that's it, car insurance has gone out, cunts, how is that fair, like I know. Somebody set my car on fire, so now I get the fucking shit end of the stick. Well, I got the shit end of the stick anyway, my car was burned down. Um, obviously, my insurance my insurance should be like 400 quid now. But because someone decided to set fire to my car, it's a grand. Great, I feel like I'm 18 again. Um, yeah, it's gone up. Gone up. What is that? I haven't done anything, so, yeah. Mum says apparently it's just going to fucking... It may go up, it may go down. It'll go down eventually, but I'm paying the price because someone wanted my wheels. Fucking hell. Right. I have a dentist appointment today. I do need to do my fake down today. I need to wash my hair today. Yeah. Seeded bread. Don't you just love seeded bread? I love it when you get a giant seed. The more seeds, the better. <gasps> like that one. That's quite a big one. No, it's not big enough. I want bigger seeds, like monster seeds. <sighs> I've made a grave, grave mistake. I've been doing my tan. I had my hair mask on. I thought, great. I'll sleep in it all, blah, blah, blah. I need my hair dry and washed so I can put my flats in it so I can have wavy hair tomorrow. I've done my tan now, so I've got these bloody marigolds and I'm going to try and... How the hell am I going to wash my hair without getting it all down my face? I'm going to have to wipe my tanning drops off my face and put them back on. Why didn't I? Why? Dentist appointment done. Such a pointless appointment. It was literally just a picture, like a scan of my teeth. And I've already had it done before, but obviously I've moved to a new dentist, so I've got to have it done again. But it literally took two minutes and it's like an hour drive. Pain in the ass. But. They only have the person that does that in on Thursdays or something, so I had to come for a separate appointment. I had to take out all my jewellery or as much as I could get out. <laughs> Look at it. I don't even know. I wore all rings. I would not have even noticed. That's not even half of it because obviously I've left some in. I didn't even have any in my main 
loops. So now I've got to put it all back in. Uh, I want to get home for tea time, so I should probably fucking hurry up, actually. Oh, that's not even my nose ring. Oh, God. Oh, God. Maybe I should just drive home and then do it at home. They heal up so fast, these piercings, though. Creamy pesto chicken, but it's not a curry. It's not a curry. It's just like pesto cream and, you know. It is supposed to be a healthy recipe, but I didn't have any low-fat cream, so it's single cream. back as light as possible but it's come to my it's come to my what's the, what's the phrase it's come to my attention it's come to my attention that i'm gonna need three because i can't travel all day and then wear the same outfit to harry styles that's gross so that means i'll be wearing the same outfit from eight in the morning until probably about midnight nah so that means i need three outfits so i'm gonna do a try and a montage look at these spot stickers they're pretty gross but i've Got loads of, well, it's my own fault for picking up my chin last night, but now I've got loads of spots on my chin. I don't know why, my eyelashes actually look really scruffy and shit at the minute because the perm's growing out, but people just, <laughs> some people, just a very small amount of people just don't want to believe that these are real lashes. Like, they're just like, these are lash extensions. This is a pathetic ad. <laughs> so I've, had to, I've had to just pluck out one of my eyelashes to prove a point. I want that back. <laughs> she owes me one. She was like, she, she, she even brought up Michaela saying I was like, Michaela, for um, if anyone doesn't know, I feel like we all know by now, that Michaela did a mascara advert and she used some false lashes in it. So then everyone just went sick. So she was comparing me to Michaela because apparently I've got false lashes on. These are real bitch. They're even blonde. They don't even look good at the minute. And I've just lost one of my best ones. It's one of the longest, curliest ones from the end. I might glue it back in. She thinks I've got lash extensions anyway, so I might as well. I thought this was a cute outfit. A bit different for me. A bit different. But are the shoes too embarrassing? Bought them for a beef and I just think they just look a bit stupid. What do we think? I feel like I need open toe situation. Mm, I'm tired. I'm fucking orange. Ready, ready, steady, cook. It's a beautiful day. It's gonna be so hot in London. It's gonna be a good two days, I think, I hope. But then again, the last gig we went to, we had a fallout. And then Avril Lavigne, we had the fallout. So maybe gigs are cursed, because I did say I wanna go and see as many people as possible this year. So maybe I've cursed myself. We'll see if the curse is broken tonight. You'll obviously see. You'll see. No, I think we're gonna have a good time. I think. I hope. I think. I hope. Prodigy tickets out in. Are they out? Oh. You got them? Oh. Getting Jake to get them whilst I drive because I'm stressed. 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 <laughs> Let me know when the confirmation is in. I didn't think he'd agree to it because. We can't go and see everyone, can we? But we can, we can. Save two minutes. We're already 30 minutes early. I don't think we should save two minutes. But we will. We will. Order complete. It says processing your payment. Don't yeah, don't tell me confirmed. before you get them. Order confirmed. Order confirmed? Yeah. Going to see the prodigy. What date? What venue? Uh, oh, this is ours. Get your stuff, Jake. <laughs> Yeah, just chuck it on top and jump on the back. We're here! Yeah. It was a right palaver on the train because Jake wanted to sit in the seats that we were allocated. Who does that? I'm not sitting in a seat in front of me for two hours. Pathetic, then he was free for free freaking out because I wanted to go and walk and find another seat. I was walking to find another seat for like 20 minutes. But I found us one. One, I got a table seat in a carriage that didn't have air conditioning and I nearly died. We both nearly died, so we had to move. But we got the, we got the table seat in the end. Jake just made everything difficult. Right, we're on Oxford Street now because Jakey wants some 
new shop. Oh, that dress is lovely. Can you see it? Oh. I'll just be stood minding my own business and Jake will be like, oh, I'm just gonna go in that shop over there. You turn around, it's like the grottiest vape shop ever. <laughs> Trump. I had to put my hair back in plaits because the, the waves went out. I should have wet it more at night and I should have done it tighter. Mm -hmm. It's not looking great, but it'll do. Yeah, it's on your fucking world. What? Hey, what is it? You did not pay 50. No, no, no. What? You went for, for tourists, for tourists. £15 for no. an elf bar for tourists? Five for me. <laughs> what? What did he do? Like, yeah, how yeah. Did you... I, I put them on the counter thinking they're just like six quid like they are around us. And I saw the sticker on the bottom and he went, and I went, oh. I went, nah, nah. He went, no, 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 that's for tourists. Oh, that's evil. At least he didn't rip you off. But I mean, Jesus. He's like, rent is so high. He's like, I know my local boys though. Oh, <laughs> fair enough, rent is well high, but I mean, I can't afford it, it's just fucking boo, 15 quid. They're not even worth it. Well, he looks at it, because I'm a tourist. <laughs> <laughs> I booked us in at this hotel that's like, it's supposed to be underground. I think it looks really cool, I hope it's nice. It looks clean anyway, so, can't be that bad. This is the room, it's tiny, it's literally like a little pod. I can... <laughs> It's cute. <laughs> oh, it's cute. It's nice. It's modern. It's clean. Cool. Okay, it's time for the Harry outfit. Ready? I'm glad I brought these glasses last minute. These really go, don't I feel like I could definitely wear... Is it dope? No, they could they, they really go. I could definitely wear this again. I like it. I wish I... My hair's not wavy though. I should have waved it. I feel like an idiot. It looks shit now. It's like not straight, it's not wavy, it's nothing. We go past some sort of GHD place to do my hair. Excuse me, we got a waver. Yeah, my hair looks shit. I'm pretty upset about that. But look at the look at that plait just sticking out. My hair looks fine. Yeah, it looks beautiful. Jake's Jake's got a new outfit. Show them. Oh, he's never wore a vest before, but it had to go with the outfit and it looks, it looks cute. Hang on, people can't see this. Can you just stand back, please? Oh. You sound like a heavy smoker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she went in outfits. Oh, you look lovely. You look lovely. You look lovely. Going to Ellen for something to eat. I've actually come here. Okay gifted meal thing which is very nice but as I say went in and I was like sure. <laughs> told her we got a booking she was like I, I don't have this booking I've not got any booking for this time the woman said she'd emailed and then no one knows about it I always do this they yeah they just, they, they've got cocktails they always oh, don't tell me they don't have cocktails at this one why is my makeup all crisp yet yeah, they always say right that's booked in um, just do us a no. post or something, blah blah blah, for some pictures. For some pictures, and then you get there, and you've never even booked to it. Yeah, I didn't even realise, but it's a halal place, that's why they don't do alcoholic cocktails. But then again, when I trace my mind back, I actually kind of, I think I did know that in the back of my head. But they're lovely drinks anyway. I've got the raspberry mojito. I don't know what Jade's got. It's not for the toilet. The toilet. Bad boy. What did you get? Uh, the full brisket burger. That's nice. I got some sort of pasta. It's got vegan and do in it, but I mean, mm. Mm, interesting. Chocolate and lotus cheesecake. Jake's brought us to a cocktail bar that's supposed to be, what is it? Four, <laughs> four out of five in, in London. 4.7 out of five. 4.7 out of five, and it's happy hour at the minute. It's fucking barely anyone here. We thought it'd be ram jammed, and these, these cocktails look shit. Is it from a Oh right, why would they have happy hour at four o'clock? No one's here. Ah, uh, well that's not an hour then, is it? Happy three hours. Happy three hours. Sorry, I'm not, I don't go out much. Oi, this is fucking sick. We've got, they've got a skull disco ball. Just you wait until he turns his head around, that's so cool. Why have I never thought of that before? Not that I think about disco balls every day. Oh my God, I want that in my room right now. I'm getting one of them in the house. Yeah. Here he comes! How cool is that? I love that! Can we have one that's like an orangutan's face instead? <laughs> With like a big disc head. Worst cocktails in London. Jake's fuming. 
So Someone pushed in front of him and yeah, ordered eight drinks. Ordered a bottle of Prosecco. And then she thought they finished. She, she took my order. And then they, all, they asked for like six more cocktails. And then the boss man from my door after like cleaning up. And he went, what, can I get this? I said, I want, can I get it? Strawberry daiquiri teapot. Hang on, can I stop you right there? You want a strawberry daiquiri teapot and then what? So he's, he pulls out the fucking teapot. Yeah. Tea cozy and everything. Right. And then she goes, oh, do you not want these daiquiris then? And I was like, have you started making them? She went, yeah, yeah. So I was like, right, I'll have them then. And I started pouring them out. Pour these pisses out. She was looking in the fucking jug for the rest of it. She was yeah, like, she was literally sick. looking at it. Like, what the fuck? She's obviously missing out because that's strong as dicks. Whoa. That does not taste like a strawberry daiquiri. Why, why did you ask one girl for something and then the next person for something else? Because she served someone, gave them a bottle of Prosecco, asked me what I wanted and then carried on serving them. Alright, oh, I see, I see. You, just, you need to learn to stick up for yourself. You should have just said, I didn't No, I think. said, have you started making them? I would like, have been yeah. like, I didn't think that you were making them. Can I speak to your manager? Well, that's what she said, yeah. I've, uh, I've pulled everything out now. Okay, do you want me to get her? I'll get her. Hey, I'll get her. We wanted to find a rooftop bar to maximise the sun, and this one's either got ground or five, so I think this is pretty promising. Oh, that looks nice. I hope it's not mega expensive. It will be. Do you think? Yeah, just one drink, just one drink. Oh, you're looking at your mouth because you like it. You do good. One Aperol each. How much is it? 15 pound each. I mean, it's not that deep, really. They're probably about 12, 11 at home. I mean, look where we are. Can you imagine the rent on the place? That's where they're getting 15 pound from. Change it up. Oh, I can't do with that spot. You're joking. Just take uh, it was actually £34 for those two drinks. It makes them £17 each for an apple. And that, I can't deal with that spot. Is that, is that, is that real life? Oh my god. No. That's not true. I'm not paying £17 a bottle. Yeah, uh, £17 each is around round for £34 for two apples. Let's just watch you in Manchester next time. Such a Manchester thing to discuss, such an up north thing to discuss. We're just sat here discussing the prices of this menu. Takes a fold. What is it? Hendrix. Hendrix. 200 quid for a 40 quid bottle of gin. Jack Daniels, that's even worse. Maybe it's a giant. Oh, look at your little digits. Jack Daniels, 180. Jack Daniels is 20 quid and you're fighting every local petrol station. My nails look sick. Something tells me we're getting close. <laughs> Wait a minute. What? What? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh, it's so good. This place looks sick. We got invited to watch the Euros here once, but we both shut up. We both had COVID, so. Not. Yeah, all right. Not 19 pounds. Yeah, I had a box fart token, but apparently I can only use it on weekdays. No discounts in this dojo. <laughs> Fuck off. You. Oh my God, there's a quiz. There's a quiz. Oh, so we were literally we were number five on the leaderboard. I can fucking 
Oh my god, he got a bit down. I don't want to watch it, Jay. I've just been doing it. I've just been doing it. Take your shame. Take your shame. <laughs> Stop! Right. I, I, did a, I, I did that bloody strip tease in bloody Paris. Paris. I know you did. Jake, Jake, right, you don't believe me. We've been together seven years yet, but I. You don't actually know this about me. No one knows this. But I am such a, I can hula hoop for as long as I want if it's a proper hula hoop. You can... And I thought I can do this shit because I'm so good at hula hooping. I got on stage, it was the smallest hula hoop and it was so light and it just fell down straight away. This was not a proper hula hoop. I even said to the guy, I was like, what's your name? What's your name? I went, big. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, 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 then I, and then I put it. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I don't remember. It's too much adrenaline. My heart was pounding, and I was doing the hula hoop, and it was just. It's it just awful, went down it? immediately. It's awful when you get on stage. And the I even tried to do it again. I was like, I'm not having this. The adrenaline's all there, but it partially kicks out. It Mate, goes away, it and it's like, oh, I fuck, think no, walking no, up to the stage was the worst part because my heart was absolutely pounding. Like, probably no one was even looking at me. I was like to the guy, what do we have to do? Do we just go on stage? <laughs> wait, wait, she's getting pictures there. Will you take a picture of my outfit? Electric powered ice cream. That's Eric's friend. We made it. It's so fucking big. I love you as well, mate. 
Who are you here with 18 weeks? Congratulations. Oh. Who are you here with tomorrow? Oh. Best friend. Do you oh. know? Yeah, nobody knows. I don't even know. I'm about what, to. I don't know what the fuck he's saying, but it's cute. You ready for this? It's the very first one. I'm sure one of these will always be there. I literally have not okay. a clue what he's go. saying. You need to update the speakers in here because it right. sounds like a ghoul. <laughs> Guys, just another fucking gender reveal. Right. It's a boy. That is mad. Congratulations. Congratulations, man. Make some noise for Lana, everybody. Woo! I'm going to stretch it out a little bit, but I think the pain, she might know. <laughs> Where are you, Lydia? Lydia, no. He's by. We're going to do this properly. What kind of music do you like, Alfie? I'll take that one, thank you. What kind of music do you like? Fast, slow, mid tempo, fast. Fast, fast. Some fast, sparkly, gay, coming out by music. <laughs> Here we go, Alfie, you are officially Every time I stand up too fast, I get shooting pains in my head. My head's throbbing. <laughs> I drank so much for me, I don't know how I wasn't sick. Big orange Afro spritz, plus I like that. I like that a lot. Need a Starbucks, need one. Need. I got a, what did I get? Iced chocolate mocha. It's actually really nice. And you got a cold brew. You're manly, aren't you? God. Black as well. Woo. Quick visit to Selfridges. It's not a London trip without it. Snuck a cheeky little bit of Tom Ford, and now we're ready to go. Oh Gorgio Harmony. <laughs> <laughs> Was that Gorgio Harmony? Look at these Prada pajamas. Can you imagine? I feel like Chloe would love these. Chloe, if I'm wrong, I'm sorry, but <laughs> fancy they are. That's unbelievable. How much do you reckon them pajamas are? They've got to be like two grand. Maybe more? Less? I don't know. I'm touching them, I'm touching them. Oh look, there's the shot. It's the shot. It's the shot. Ooh, yeah. pork spring rolls with Jake's wings. Jake's wings. Swap. Swap, 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 swap. Just noticed I've lost my day hoop. Oh, I'm gutted. I absolutely loved that hoop. It was solid gold as well. Absolutely gutted. It was never really good at fastening though the glass on it was always shit. Oh, I'm so gutted. I think that is a problem though with solid gold stuff. I think because obviously gold's soft, isn't it? I think, yeah, I think that's just a thing. Oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? Do I buy another one? Mm. We got the beef one. Well, I got the beef one this time. You, Jake normally gets the beef one. I normally get curry. What no, is it? No, beef brisket. The ones that I've been Normally, oh that. yeah. <laughs> Had to come and pick up a new day too. I just have to. I mean, why would I not? There's only one shop in London and then the other's in Brighton, so I might as well. May as well. This is what I 
got, we've got this necklace that I really wanted last time. And then this. So Which I didn't know were a pair, I thought it was just one, so I'm pretty happy with that. I thought it was just, I was just going to put it into garbage. I know you shouldn't put butterfly bags in garbage, but I was going to put it into it crazy. And then, the A food replacement, slightly different to the last one. So it's nice to have a change, but I'm so sad. Oh no! Why did you want one yesterday when I was doing it? Because, look at this! That would be so cute for my London trip. And it's, it's nice and tiny, so it's like a one night thing. Do I bother? It's 41 pounds. No, wait, I think it's 36. It's the pink one, it's 36. Which is not that good, but still. Tragic. There was literally nothing there, so I had to get in this, this birthday card. I want to scribble it out. But you get me the last minute. I had to get him a candle. Last minute gifts, a curly whirly that he likes. These beers that he likes, but I don't know if they're the right ones because the, the blonde ones were sold out. So I really hope they're the ones he likes. Basically, don't leave things till bloody last minute. And then what else have I got? Oh yeah, I'm making his tea tomorrow. So that's nice, but overall very disappointing for me. It was funny because you just saw the horror on people's faces when they went in and there was like no cards and we we're all just looking at each other like, fuck. So I walked in and went, shit. So I looked at him and went, shit. And this girl just turned to me and started laughing. We've all done the same thing, look. And then there was funny, there was just, there was two cards left and one was just really embarrassing. It was like, it was two hippos and one was blown up like a balloon floating. And it just had the words, fat dad, fat. It was so shit. And everyone was like, I'm just gonna have to get this one. And then you, <laughs> and then you, you pick up and then you picked it up. And then it didn't even have an envelope. And that's the only reason it was left. And then you just say, I see everyone picking it up going, oh, if I have to. It was funny. Ah, who wants to see my new ears? This is probably going to be really unflattering, but this is the only way I could do it with flash. So that's my new flower one. I just wanted them all to like sync up with the pink. I need like, um, I'm going to change the charm. Is this even focused? I'm gonna change the charm on this to a pink one and then it's all gonna be like pinky pink. Yeah, I think. I like the flower theme as well. And then in this ear, I actually think I could have one more piece in there, you know, like a tiny little dot there. It's kind of cool. Thought it was done on that ear, but I just, I love piercings. And then on this ear, there's my new days. It's nice and spiny, spiny, sparkly and shiny. Oh, it is nice, I do like it. I'm still upset though. And then, oh yeah. This one, Jake picked this one. He's just put it in for me. I did try and put it in on the train, but it's got a, a ball at the back. Oh my God, I could not do that with these fucking nails. Nearly dropped it. Imagine if I dropped that on the train floor. I think that was 62 pound, that one. I think it's solid gold. Look at the sparkle. That's cute, isn't it? That's cute. Shame about this saggy low. Might get it stitched up one day. I really enjoyed being curly today and wearing a long skirt. I'm going to invest in some more long stuff. I always thought it'd make me look stupid, but who knows? Maybe it does, but I like it. I wish it had a slit, though. I think it's a bit, I don't know, it needs a slit. I didn't get pictures in this outfit, though, and I like to... I always find it so difficult getting pictures, finding the right lighting. Oh, God, and then... I don't like when people look at you, it's too much, it's too much, I get too nervous. So yeah, and then the outfit I went down and didn't get a picture in, so I'm just going to have to wear them all again. Everything again. Oh, and this is my new necklace, look. Your gal spent, she spent up, but I used, I used Chloe's student discount again, I got 15% off. It's pretty good that, it's 200 quid for everything. But I mean, there's some solid gold pieces in there. There's some pieces for life. Hi, look at this. I look like a little boy that's been shaving. I look like the Grinch. Oh, that's me in that part. Exactly right. They've got loads of spots for some reason. Don't know. Mugged off. I feel like we've not caught up since last night. But I mean, we were so drunk. Me and Jake were so drunk. I do not know. And then we got in and we thought, oh, we need Whoa. some. We need. 
we need don't open it. We need some food. There was nothing open. We was that desperate. We was gonna order some sh from some shit chicken shop. Then Jake finally found some pizza shop. We ordered that. I was shutting my eyes by the time we ordered. I was so tired. And then we both just fell asleep after ordering it. Luckily, because it was forty quid that order. Luckily, praise the Lord. Because I remembered in the night and I was like, Jake, the pizza. Jake, the pizza. But he wouldn't wake up. And then uh, in the morning, the order had been cancelled. Thank the Lord. But we had a really good time. We had a really good time, didn't we? A really good night. Wembley was. It was fun to experience a new thing. It's so fucking big. It's cool. I've been to Wembley. I can say that now. But when we left, God, it took us two hours to get home. We was just like all walking at snail's pace because there was that many people. All going to walk. It took us like an hour to get to into the tube stop. The tube was like a fucking pack of sardines. It was mad. It was poor two hours hard, to actually. get home. What do you think? Yeah, but how, how else are they supposed to manage all those people? No, I get that, but I just, you'd be more... I don't know, really. We probably should have got the bus, or I don't know. But I think what is best to do in that situation is probably just get a hotel at Wembley. If you want to save yourself the two hours, I mean, was it that much of an inconvenience? We were talking to people, we were talking to everyone. There was a girl crying because she was, she thought that Harry wasn't going to tour again. She was a Harry super fan. And we were talking to her and her mum on the job because her mum loved Elvis. Her mum was an Elvis super fan. Can't believe they went straight to the airport. They went straight to the airport because they'd just flown. No, they no, come no. from Ireland, don't they? They'd just flown just to see Harry because he's Harry's super fans. Yeah, we had a good chat. But that that commute home was not the one. <laughs> it was fun, but it was, it was fun, fun in a fun way that I would never want to do it ever again. <laughs> it, oh, it, it was like coming back from part like oh yeah yeah exactly that when you're all like kind of like you can't be out to just get me all yeah it was all right it was all right we met some weirdos actually didn't we that polish girl oh my she God. gave me freaky vibes i thought she was gonna push me in the drag she was serious i was very she unsure was about her that is wrong but no one were all. yeah she reminded me of someone off hostel yeah very unsure i want a party i and Sophia and Chinsia were there. I didn't even know. I was in the same room as so many people that I know without knowing. Sophia, I don't know Sophia and Chinsia, but yeah. Where's Katie's car? I don't know. Sophia and Chinsia, they've been in the same room as me. They didn't even, in fact, they've been in the same room as me a few times. I don't know why I'm talking about that. Who's closer to them before? Um, yeah. God, they've seen them enough times now. Let some other people have tickets. Does that look like their fourth time? I'd go four times if I could. Kebab. Spooky film in bed. God, I didn't even video that kebab. I must have eaten it that fast. <laughs> I never forget to video anything. Don't pray to. I'm, I'm more than sure we've already watched this. Spooky girls. Oh my God, soft launch. Hello, good morning. It is daddy's day today. Happy daddy's day, everyone. I didn't emerge from bed until half ten, so I'm currently getting home at ten to eleven, which is not great. I like to be there when he wakes up. I don't want him lingering, thinking, "Oh, she's not going to come home." He knows I'm going to come home because I'm making tea. But yeah, I just I don't know. I like to be there in the morning, but I needed that sleep. I needed that sleep. Oh my god, one of my spot stickers come on. Oh my god, that feels like it's gone worse. Ay, ay, ay. I need to go home. I need to very quickly write this fucking Disney princess card. And I need to just spend some time with the big bald man. Just popped upstairs to the stock room because I really want to try these. And I, well, I've not bothered yet. Uh, they're, they're Huda Beauty and lip blushes. I'm sure I had another colour. Can't seem to find that one. I'm sure I kept it downstairs to try. Who knows? But I hope one of these is right for me i think it should be hey viva's in full swing today i've had to put another one of them gross spot stickers on i like a spot sticker that's pretty but i feel like these these are serious i feel like these do the job rather than just looking nice the way i do have these ones i thought nice i'll have a little love, love heart one look how big they are how stupid would i look walking around with them on my face so oh 
don't think they like that. So they're like tiny little clear love hearts underneath. And then that's just the packaging, I think. The pink stuff. Oh, all right. Wow, well, I would have put them on. It doesn't really make a difference, does it? But the same. These look medical. Um, yeah, we know I like a bit of temporary makeup. Tanning drops. Not temporary. What's the other word? You know what I mean? Um, Semi-permanent makeup. Tanning drops. Tin. Tin. Lash perm. So these are lip stains. Oh, it's lip and cheek stain. So I don't know whether you're supposed to put it on. It's an all day stain. These are supposed to be really good for just keeping a sharp lip line whilst you're eating and stuff. Apply directly on your lips using the applicator. And then for your cheeks, apply a small amount on your cheek with the applicator immediately blend. All right, so you don't rub it off. What have I got here? Rosy Kiss and Berry Kiss. I think, oh, I don't know, I think, I don't know, I don't know, because my face is pale because I've been scrubbing it so much. All right, so this is Berry Kiss. Oh, that's like very brown. I think probably Rosy Kiss for me, but not if it's that cool tone. Rosy, yeah, Rosy Kiss for me. <laughs> They'll both be very nice, but I need tan on for Berry Kiss. Oh, the hay fever is hay fevering today. Very interesting. So it's it doesn't really look like the colour that it would be. It's very pinky. It almost like develops on your lips. But this is the side obviously with and without. Right, Come in! Nice sharp lip line. So I suppose you just wait for it to dry. I really shouldn't be wearing this with no makeup on. It doesn't make sense, but here we go. Then I think you just wait for it to dry. Hmm. I think I should wipe it because it looks stupid with no makeup on, doesn't it? For God's sake. But I'm just about to eat a big sandwich. So we'll see how well it holds up. I cannot keep this on my nose. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Let's see you go up. Lift it up. Oh, it's right, you <laughs> Did you know you've got that one? Happy Father's Day, mate. Thank you. Thanks for the lovely present. <laughs> hmm. It's a nice colour, that. It's gone very dark. Also, hmm. it's a bit uneven, actually, but I think when she does it, it's very even. So I think I just need to work on my application. I'm going to give it a wipe because obviously I look stupid. But hopefully, hopefully it looks all right after a wipe. All right, well... Obviously, you're not usually supposed to wipe it, but I think that could be quite good on a um, nice little day out, night out. If you had a tan face and you didn't look like, oh, look, what is going on? Yes, I need a lighter colour though, I think. More pale pink. I don't know where that other one went. Oh, I'm really sweet. I'm just so tired. I don't know why. Maybe two days in London really does take it out of you. It is a lot, but is it enough to make you this tired? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I promised I'd take Dad to the, the local pub. Local pub for local lads. Um, so yeah, and then I'm making that lovely TikTok pasta again because you've requested it. I also ordered some, I don't know how you pronounce it, book. Bucatini, 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 that sounds better, doesn't it? Is it B-U-C-A-T-I-N-I? -I? don't know. So, um, basically, the thick spaghetti, I've always wanted some. Nowhere ever sells it, not even TK Maxx. So, I ordered it from Amazon, so hopefully it comes in time. It's, it says it might come at quarter to six, so I'd love that. If not, we're on normal spag. Normal spag. Hey, look, I bought this as well. What the fuck? Cheers, mate. Ah, ha, ha. Get inside, schnauzer. <laughs> Not in there. Oh god, it smells great.
Oh, oh, he's hidden in there because he's scared. Anyway, as I was saying, I got this. It's £36, but I just think, how cute is that? And it's a perfect cabin size. Cabin approved. And yeah, just because this one, the smallest suitcase we have for London, it's ripped at the bottom. So, yeah. I needed a new case. And I got this little kiddies one. How fun is that? I love that. Cheers, Jenna. Thank you very much. It's arrived. It's got a hole in it, I didn't know that. I thought it was just fat spaghetti, but it's got... Check. Almost like giant macaroni. Oh. Yeah, I can get that bloody... Can I Well, can you get this one? Yeah. Right, well, can you buy it then? Don't have to get it off Amazon, I can. Easy peasy. Right, we'll do that then. That's how shocking this shit is. Yeah, check how much it is. It's £2.50 a packet for me. Alright. <laughs> Chocolate birds, they're so much bigger than that, like pear. Whoa, I need a bigger pan. Wow, and we've got thunderstorms as well, haven't we? And fresh bread. Thank you, Dana. Best Father's Day ever. Why? Love you. Wow, this is the best. This is just lovely. Very seriously. Fair enough. Happy Father's Day. Right, that was actually that was a successful day. Oh shit! Dad was happy. Tea was fit. Everyone had seconds. That tea was so nice. Oh my god! I don't think I've linked it yet, but I'll eventually I'll get there. So fucking good. And that it's actually pronounced Bugaccini. Bugaccini. That sounds beautiful. Isn't it? Wish I was Italian. Is it Italian? It's probably Italian. It sounds fucking Italian. Bucatini. Beautiful. Fantastic pasta that. I didn't know it had a hole in it as well. It's not did I already say this? It's not just thick spaghetti, it's like a giant macaroni. Yeah, it's really good. Great, great texture. Good for soaking up sauce. It's just a shame that Tesco don't do it. Or anywhere. You sell it at Cardo, but it was actually more expensive at Cardo than uh Amazon, my mum checked. I paid two pounds fifty a packet, and at a card it was two pounds sixty. Disgusting. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna leave it there because, well, all we're gonna do now is fucking cuddle, eat, and chat shit. So there's nothing interesting there for you. I had a really good weekend. What a great weekend! That was a good weekend. I hope it was fun to watch. I don't know because I haven't edited yet. Of course, I probably never will. No, I will. I'm gonna get this one edited on time. Everyone's had a joyous week and I'll see you next week.